Hey guys, so it's that time again. Story time with me, and I'm really excited to talk to you guys about um, how I was adopted and my childhood. A lot of people are like, oh my God, she's not really Italian. She's from Chile, Santiago, but it's facts. I was adopted, um, and I don't really talk about it just because I just feel like my family is my family, you know? I never really thought, oh, like, what's my birth mother like? What's my, you know, birth family like? Because I'm so content with my adopted parents and my adopted life and family. But, you know, I, I thought about it once I started to get older, like, oh, what does my mom look like? What does my dad look like? So, story, story time right now. I was adopted at six months from Santiago, Chile and I was adapted by Helen and Andrew Palizzi. And they came, they flew all the way to Chile to come pick me up. And they said right when they saw me, I was like, mama, dada. So it was like meant to be. I could tell because, you know, things just work out that way. It's called fate. So I was always meant to be with my adoptive parents, which I don't even, ew, I hate saying adoptive parents because they're my parents, it's weird. I'm just, it doesn't affect me like that, like other adoptive, um, adopted kids feel, I guess. Um, I'm just very content with it. So six months, they picked me up from Santiago, Chile, and the rest is history. Um, my parents lived in upstate New York, Marlboro, New York to be exact, um, but it's like the Newburgh area, an hour out of Albany, two hours out of the city, so like in the middle of that, I grew up there. Um, everyone was amazing, so even though my nationality is Chilena, um, I grew up Italian. So I feel like when people said, what's your, when people say to me, what's your nationality? I say, um, I'm Chilena, but I grew up Italian. So I feel like I'm both. Um, but yeah, my parents have always been amazing. And anytime I did ask, because I always knew, they didn't have to tell me, they didn't have to sit me down at 10 and be like, Nicole, you're adopted. Like I knew, I'm like, we don't look alike. I'm brown, you're white. This doesn't make sense, but like I always knew in my heart that I was adopted and I was totally fine with it. So I would say once I was like 16, 17, I was like, I, I started to think, all right, why didn't my birth parents want me? Um, what do they look like? Do I have any brothers and sisters? Because I grew up an only child. Um, so I always wanted like, you know, a brother or sister to hang out with hate being an only child because it makes me a bitter bitch that I am today. So that's why I want like 10 kids so they don't feel that way. Um, but yeah, I started to be like, all right, what do they look like? Where are they from? And every time I would ask my parents, they would get upset. My mom would be like, uh, let's not talk about it. I just could tell they would get upset because they didn't want to like tell me the truth or they, they didn't want me to think that, um, they're not my parents, which was never the case. So I just stopped asking. And eventually, when I was like 21, 22, I got my dad drunk and I was like, Dad, can you just tell me what went on? Like, why was I up for adoption? And basically, um, you know, my birth parents had other siblings and they couldn't afford me, womp. So I can't even imagine, because I have two kids, like putting up a child for adoption to, give them a better life, like that's so amazing for them. That shows how much they loved me, but also I could never do that. I could never do that. So I can't even imagine how they felt giving me up, but thank you for that. Um, but yeah, my dad was just like, they had other siblings, they couldn't, they couldn't afford me, and they just wanted to give me the best life ever. So I was like, all right, that's fine. But now, not even thinking about my birth parents, I'm like, mm, I always wanted a brother or sister. What do they look like? Do they act like me? And you know, would I ever want to meet them? I think I would. I definitely think I would want to meet my birth family. But how would we communicate? Because I took Spanish for three years and I failed every single time, which is so weird because I'm naturally supposed to speak Spanish and I can't. I'm like, hola, como estas? Like I'm an asshole about it. So if I did meet them, we would have to use an interpreter because I can't speak Spanish at all. But I'm definitely open for, um, that opportunity. And I know a lot of people, a lot of um, my fans that are adopted, they always ask me questions like, do you ever want to meet them? Do you ever have contact with them? My mom is still iffy about it, like when I bring it up, so I don't like bringing it up, but I feel like I'm 30 years old, I could do it myself. So if I really wanted to meet my birth family, I could actually figure it out. I just, I don't have the time right now, you know? And when I was growing up, I always wanted someone to look like me. 
And I was like, oh, I really just want someone to look like me because obviously my mom and my dad didn't look like me. So once I had my kids that kind of filled that void of, okay, like my daughter's my twin, my son looks 50-50 like me and my husband. So like I was fine with that. But in the back of my head, I'm always curious to meet my birth family. So I don't know, maybe that could be a vlog. Maybe I could do it one day when I have time, you know? I'm definitely interested. I don't know when I'm gonna do it, but I'm interested. But overall, being an adoptive kid, I am blessed at the fact that I have my adopted parents. They give me an amazing life, um, and they deal with my shit, which is crazy. And I always wonder if I never was adopted and I stayed with my birth parents, would I still be a hot mess like this, just in Spanish? Probably. I feel like I was always meant to be this hot mess. Um, but I'm definitely thankful for my life. So if you guys are adopted, Ask me questions because I would love to talk about it more. I'd never really talk about it just because it's not like a thing for me. Like I'm, I'm fine with it, I'm content. So I would love to talk more about it. So if you guys are adopted or, or you have questions about it or you want to adopt, which is so amazing, comment below. I will do another video about it. And you know, maybe when I have time, I'll try and find my birth parents, who knows? All right, so I love you guys. Make sure you tune in next week or the week's coming because I'm gonna do more story time. And thanks for listening. Mwah. Love you. Bye.